I got this toilet from a man who bought three of my toilets. He dropped this one off and two others in parchment color. They were replaced because his wife wanted white. These lines here are actually carved into the porcelain, so they are permanent. And as you can see, somebody did a bad job of painting over it right here. It doesn't really show up on the camera too well, but it's really noticeable in person. They did the same thing on this side too. And also it looks like they even painted over some of the wax right here. Thankfully, the original tank bolts are still in really nice shape. So I shouldn't have too much trouble getting those off. And same goes for the handle. That's also original and in very nice condition. Usually these have a steel screw, but this one is brass, which is very nice because it'll make it easy to remove. The original parts in this toilet are the tank bolts and the flush valve and probably the tank to bowl gasket. The flapper is just one of those hardware store ones and the fill valve is of course a corky. It's set to a little bit below the water line. That's how it was when I got it, so I'm going to see how it flushes. Of course the seat is mismatched as well, but it actually doesn't look like a bad seat. It's a real it's a real thick one. I like this seat a lot, so if I get a beige toilet, I definitely know where to put it. This has an extremely weak flush. I'll be back when I set the water level to the water line and I'll see how it flushes then. Now it's set to pretty much exactly the water line, so let's see how it flushes. Pretty much the same. I'm not a fan of that flush. At least it's better than the one I have from 1981 because that one sometimes didn't even siphon on its normal water level. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and turn on notifications. It helps my channel a lot and I really appreciate it. Thanks for watching and see you guys in the next video.